Among all museums, there is only one with New York City in its name. The Museum of the City of New York really is about connecting the city together. It's totally focused on New York City. The museum celebrates and interprets the city's history, especially its heritage of diversity, opportunity, and perpetual transformation. Since 1923, the Museum of the City of New York has celebrated and interpreted the history of the five boroughs. Today, with its cutting edge programming and dynamic transformation, the museum is experiencing a renaissance. The museum prides itself on this ever changing series of exhibitions. Stephen Burroughs is an utterly exciting show. He really defined the look of the disco generation. When Fashion Danced is a perfect title because his clothing is so danceable. Activist New York explores one of the defining qualities of New Yorkers. New York has always been a city where people always try to do the right thing to make the world a better place. It looks at 14 episodes in the history of social activism in New York City and it really helps us to understand the nature of this city. We have an exhibition going on right now called Making Room. Making Room is all about the apartment space of tomorrow, how you can live in a very functional, roughly 300 square foot apartment. We are showcasing an initiative of the city, which is to see if the city should allow developers and building owners to provide units that are less than 400 square feet of space. Education remains a cornerstone at the museum. Through the FAO Schwartz Children's Center, the museum serves tens of thousands of students and teachers each year. Each year, we align what we do to the New York State curriculum standards. We made a difference in kids' lives. We not only told them all about the city we live in, but more importantly, what people who live in the city are capable of. Those stories are inspirational to our future generation of citizens. Through exhibitions, school and public programs, and publications, the museum connects the city's past with its present and future in thought-provoking ways. Right now, if you're doing a research project, you look on the web. We have uploaded 120,000 images and objects in furtherance of educating New Yorkers and visitors at the Museum of the City of New York. A $95 million project to modernize and expand the City Museum's building is drawing to a close. What this allows us to do, this restoration, we can take exhibitions, we can show exhibitions, we can preserve our collections. We now have, basically, from an environmental perspective, 100% museum-compatible and friendly space. With exhibitions as diverse as the city itself and an ever-evolving online presence, the Museum of the City of New York draws visitors from all over the world and engages them in a dialogue about who we are as a city. The city has gone through an incredible renaissance and we at the Museum of the City of New York want to be as exciting a place as the streets of New York City are. The Museum of the City of New York has come a long way, but the best is still ahead of us. And the visitor is going to be able to come and walk away with a visitor experience, truly understanding the stories as to why this city is the greatest city in the world. <laughs>